Days are long, weather is glorious, and flowers are filled with nectar. Your colony is probably thriving. As usual, your role as a beekeeper is to make sure your hive is healthy. So it's now time for your summer inspection. In this inspection, just like in the spring inspection actually, you want to look for three things. First, that your queen is healthy and laying properly. Two, that your colony still has room to grow. And three, that there are no queen cells. Are you ready? Let's do it. So, what you want to do now is you want to pry apart your two bee boxes and you want to take the upper one and put it diagonally on your cover. You also want to leave the inner cover on top so the bees stay calm. Ah, in this frame I can see some larvae. That's really cool, it means the queen is not too far. And on the other side are eggs. And that's also great news because it means the queen was here um, in the past three days. Aha! On this frame, it's really interesting. We've got a queen cell, and it's clearly a swarm cell. So since I now know that I have a good and healthy queen, I'm actually gonna make the decision to scrape it. Oh, that's interesting. There's, um, there's another one. I kind of knew there would be other ones because usually um, when you see one, you can be pretty sure there's gonna be some other ones. So I'm also gonna scrape this one. Okay. So, I've now gone through all the frames in my first box and I've answered two of my questions. I know I have a queen and that she's laying properly. And I also know that I have queen cells. So I'm gonna have to make sure there aren't any more queen cells in my second bee box. So let's check it out. As you can see, I've just put my second box back on top of my first box. And that's for two reasons. First, it seals off the bottom box, which I've just disturbed and also it helps me to work with a better posture. Wow. The bees worked really hard since our last inspection. If in your second box you notice that you have at least uh, eight build frames or more, make sure to read our article about um, adding a third bee box. Oh, and before I forget, we're getting closer to the 25 degrees Celsius right now. So make sure that um, your water fountain, your water feeder, is always filled up with fresh water for your bees. Also make sure to remove the entrance reducer as it'll help with the hive's ventilation. So I have to go through each and every one of these frames now to make sure I don't have any other queen cells. <laughs> 